hello guys and welcome to my new carving video. This time playing tier 7, tier 8 and even 8-3. Spares are hard counters to carving, but if you play it right you might win even versus same IP. Mainly spacing your defensives, not letting him to get too many free cues while kiting on you and definitely playing this matchup on pure miss sniper. Tier 7 carving versus 6-3 Badon. Use Inferno Shield to reflect this E and have higher defensives. Keep Helmet of Valor to purge his boots and ideally keep your E and W to catch up with him when he uses his W to space out. Spitting the thing is about the rose, but oh, hello there. Blood letters are your easy food. Inferno shield for a first stalker jacket. If IPD is not big, you can purge his boots afterwards and just chase him down. Keep your stacks always and use W only when he uses W and E only when he uses his E away. Versus higher IP bloodletters definitely keep purge for his second stalker jacket. Mirror matchup, but this guy had Fiend Cavill, higher specs and better carving. We had same trade, but he was using Inferno Shield, so I just purged it and kept my Mistwalker Jockey to theoretically dodge his E or W. Missed my oh, W, fuck. not ideal, but made him miss E by Eing through him and immediately sidestepping. Okay, that's good. Now it's just chasing time, keeping Helmet of Valor for potential undead cape reveal. Unfortunately, we were found by 8-1 Dual Swords Red.
I managed to run away from him, but till I found the body, it was opened and he stole more than 25 mil in loot. Sag. Bro, where the fuck did I kill the guy? Yeah, here. No! No fucking... I would love him Yo, to, for, uh, to go for a uh, poison hunter. Tier 7 carving, my usual assassin jacket build versus 6 3 carving. Easy bait, made him use poison pot to dismount me, so now I have 20% HP advantage. Assassin jacket for extra E damage, keeping helmet of valor for undead cape so I can use W and E on cooldown. He pushed my martel cape good, but the healing pot came handy and I came on top. Tier 7 carving versus tier 8 spare. Started with 1 bar less HP, OC as spare is counter and he is 1 tier higher. Purging his inferno shield and he decided to play into my inferno shield which was mistake. Boots to catch up as he just used cripple. Keeping W to catch up if he goes for E through me. Luckily I used E at the same time as he did, but he missed his and now I'm that just chasing as he lost the me. trade hard. Sorry Kanjo, I love you. But it was Kanjo! Kanjo, I'm sorry! A3 carving versus 6 3 carving, not much to say, this guy didn't even try. Maybe point on advice for you boys, keep your Mistwalker jacket for potential execute so you can have at least chance of running away. Tirate carving, catching Adderer. I met him a little bit ago, but also so on my way 5 to Fiber. Knowing he will go there, I went back dismounted and of course he was here gathering. Poor guy even put himself into combat. Easy to mill. He's here. Oh no. 8-1 overcharge light player. Okay, he's 8-1 overcharge. Let's uh, let him this one. Tier 7 carving versus 6-3 overcharge light color. Weird matchup. Again, baited poison pot, so I had potion advantage. He used Vel well his invis for my inferno shield, and I kept my E all time waiting for his E so I can dodge the damage. But he never used it. Killed him, wow. ran away from Pathetic Red, and got the loot. Light color, raged bro, 6-3 is expensive as fuck. I only played and don't have 5 cell for sets by Hamilton's first by Hamilton. First by Hamilton's? Well, you never fight a life cross. He was life cross, but I don't care. It's kind of a combo of the Hamilton's. 269 is actually way more than I expected. Uh, I would say I rate this 9 from, uh, 9 from 10.
tier 7 carving versus 4453 masterpiece bow. Not much to say, poor guy had no idea what to do. Uh, what is happening? Now, lovely 1v2. I was tier 8 and tier 7 Bladater and tier 6 Claymore decided to team up on me. Spacing my defensives, trying to hit W and E on both of them if possible. Assassin Jacket bait worked perfectly and got them both in the end. Pathetic teaming. Imagine teaming versus one tier higher. Whoa. I'm tier 7 though, but I can overcharge. You'll probably have way more uh, buffs than I will. Oh, chest, chest, chest! <gasps> Purple! I'm not fighting you. GGS, I already have a uh, price of my uh, gear in my inventory. Nice. Hello. Why subbing for first Q and the, oh, and then W? Tier 7 carving versus 6 3 dead givers. He even swapped Q and W to counter me, but he didn't know that I had big PP energy plan. Okay, my plan wasn't counting with having 5 seconds cooldowns from beginning to be fair. He had 2 Q stacks on me, so E into W into boots to kite the stacks out. Stacks resetted, back to Bravo. Inferno shield as he has no purge. Giga potion, ready for his second combo. Purge for his mercenary jacket together with 3 stacks on me, that guy is now doomed. Random Varbo stole the kill and nearly got me too. By the way, I still had that masterpiece bow in my inventory, so it was luckiest escape ever. Four four six three carving versus eight one full spec prowling, swapping to Perry. Didn't want to fight him at the beginning as there was five four seven three carving around, but the prowling was insisting, so let's do it. I was keeping my Perry for his third Q, but at that time SBI created another bug free patch where Perry was sometimes not working. What? I fucking parried that shit, bro. What? I was bad like Mike. Uh. 
Just check it out. In the middle of the animation, receiving damage and not reflecting anything back. Wonderful. Thank you SBI once again for a sports ready game. By the way, those who watch me for a longer time already know that I died to bugs multiple times and multiple times of road to SBI. Did I receive any answer as a content creator? You yeah. bet I didn't. Two months and counting since their last answer. We can't reproduce that bug, so bug doesn't exist. Rofomau, just imagine. I need to touch his knee, he's knee that I did again. Here, 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 fucking wildfire go. Double Giga Invincibility. And he got wrecked it. Bro, wow. Well, I will use these last fights as a spot to talk to you, my lovely viewers. I wanted to thank every single one of you for watching my content, for liking and for being Level subscribed. Crazy, it really lot, means bro. a lot and I have a one small dream of reaching 10k subscribers before end of the year. Can we do it? Even my birthday is in two weeks, so you can all be so kind and click that subscribe button. It will mean a portal to me. Thanks. I and don't forget to come on Twitch moment. sometimes, I stream daily, it always makes me happy when I see someone in chat coming from YouTube. I can answer your questions live, so come and nice say hi. Rate. Have a great weekend boys, your noob, Grinder.